Hi. In this video we are going to see how to use form endpoints to capture data submitted from an Elementor form widget. With easy forms endpoints you can capture any post request as long as it passes the form validation configured by the form builder, form settings or form add-ons. In this example, we are going to capture data from text fields, email, number field, drop-downs and text area. As you can see, both forms must have the same fields. Elementor form widget can send a webhook every time it receives a new entry, so we are going to use this feature to integrate it with easy forms. Keep in mind that Elementor sends the data as an associative array. So we are going to use a recent feature that we have implemented in easy forms to map that array. We call this feature, alias with dot notation. As value that Elementor sends follows this structure, fields, field ID, value. The field alias structure should have the same structure. Then, we must use each field alias to map the post request that Elementor is going to send. Ok, now we are going to save the form. We are going to, publish and share. Download the HTML. Form endpoint. Let's copy the URL. In Elementor, we click on, Actions after submit. We select, Webhook. We click on, Webhook, and paste the easy forms URL. It is important that we activate the, Advanced Data option, to send the data as associative array. Finally, we save the page. Now we are going to submit the form. Let's see the submission manager. Perfect. As you can see, the form data has been correctly captured from the external form. Easy right? 